Hello everybody, this is XDarkerX here, welcome back to another episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. And this time it is the Harpy Lady, Joey Wheeler versus my Valentine. Let's go, we are at Joey of course. And most of the time in the tournament for his loved one, Joey is fighting for his own reasons. For his sister, Serenity, to get the money for her operation. Her medication was really, oh, the med meditative moment was really broken down. My Joey's interrupted by Taya, as Maya was coming. The self list who challenges Joe because she knows she can thrash him, even though she's she's the one who's going to get it to the face. That did not sound very good, but uh, well, rude minded people. Scrap this side So I have lost this one before, so hopefully we won't get wrecked this time. Right, let's go. Nice. So second to go, Martha's been in our preferred to go second. Come on, Joey. Let's duel. So what do we get? What do we get? Grave robber. That's not a bad start. Hysteric sign. Can you have his destroyed set to go and add up to three harbor cards for definition from your from your deck to your hand? Jesus Christ. Okay, so we need some pretty decent here. Um, so, Graceful Charity. Uh, we should get rid of Battle Warrior and one of the Masked Legendary Sultans. Also, Jerry Beans Man, because he's a pretty awesome card. And we should attack his face now. Come on, yes! Oh, it's a Harpy Lady, awesome. So, um,. In the end phase of this turn, was sent to the field, to the field or hands to the graveyard out to free. That is an OP card. Okay, we're going to leave it there for this turn. Your turn, my. What's he going to do? Hobby's hunting ground, oh dear. Hobby's channeler. Hobby's hunting ground. Destroy that. We don't want to be done, he's using anything. Oh, oh, rip. There we go. Ah. This is going to be a problem now. I think we might have to do a time wizard this turn. Okay, there's no point using grave robber to be honest, because there's no point. Yeah, but we're going to have to do a time wizard this turn. Because otherwise we are in trouble already. Harpy lady, Jesus. <laughs> Harpy deck isn't that bad. Uh, story level 4. Yep, we're gonna have to do Time Wizard. Time magic. Come on, Time Wizard. Yes! Oh, yes. And we can attack her to do 500 to the face. But, you know, that's gonna save us for this turn. But, uh, yeah, we're still gonna have a bit of bother next turn. Yeah, hop cream. Fourteen hundred, not too bad. Uh, right, so we'll, I think we'll go Lady Bird of Doom this turn, because then that will destroy any four level force she's got on the field, which will probably be quite, you know, there'll be at least another one. So she'll leave her wide open for an attack next turn. Awesome, another, another level four. So attack that and GG, bitch. Yeah, <laughs> nice. So she's up for an attack this turn. Oh, battle logs. Nice draw. We'll have battle logs. And then we'll do 1700 to the face. Nice. And hope that she can't pull out some awesome combo this turn. Because we're getting back into it now. So we'll see what we can. What she does. Right, it's defensive. Yeah, it's just defense. So we're, we're, we're getting back into it now. Awesome. Axe Raider. Another nice draw. Yes, we came from behind. We're going to come back from this one. And yes, Hoppy Girl destroyed. And it's 1700 to the base. Awesome. So defensive again. Who the hell? I'm gonna make a draws here. She's not. Double sacrifice and ruin Kaiser because there's not much. It's not much better than what we've got. Yeah, 1800. We've got two 17s on the field. So we'll get Chuggy Coco. Cozy even. Uh, Koji Kosi. We'll attack with him, because if we attack with him and destroy it, then that's pretty cool. Oh, what's that? 
No. Oh, it's 3400 to the face. We're going to win if we're going to win. Nice. So if she doesn't do something really insane, we won. It's game. Let's turn. Be spell. Ah, it's just a trap card, bitch. Defensive again. Alright, so if we destroy that, it's game. Yep, game. Nice battle, mine. 10 million, and he, we win! Awesome, I think we'll do another duel, because it's going to be 5 minutes, so the next one, we'll skip this. Yep, you got wrecked. Hop you go, he, it goes to tower, it's not a big card. And the next one will be Attack from the Deep, Yugi versus Mako Tsunami. So, the Mako deck's not bad, actually. So it should be a pretty interesting oh but we get to go second on this one. So let's grab a drink. That's better. Right. Yugi versus Nako Tsunami. Not a bad start, not a bad start. Let's get you Umi on the field of course. 200 points of the So machine and pyros. So we don't want any pyros and machines out. Ah, swords, that's not bad. Um, I think we'll go with Destroyer Golem. Oh, Total Tribute, rip. Um, we'll go swords just to stop him from attacking us. Okay. What's he got? Mad Lobster. That's, that's, that's a good card. Wastelands increased uh, um, dinosaur zombie rock. That's an interesting one. So we'll go for that one. And then we'll summon. Because they can't attack, so we'll end there. And then we'll, next turn we'll be able to return one to his hand, which is nice. So yeah. That's his end his turn, that's nice. So we've got another golden sentry. So we'll set another one then. We'll flip some in this. To get to send that bitch back to his hand. Uh well that's base effect to reset him. And then we shall leave it there. So while he's doing his turn, I'll just replace this text. Sorry about that. Very unprofessional, I know. I apologise for that. <laughs> oh no! Oh, that was last turn. That's fine. Oh, a pot of greed. Nice. It's just what we needed. Attack on the moon. What's that? Once per turn, when the battle position in the you can you can target. Uh, one spell attract card from controls and destroy it. Okay, so we'll go. We'll use Attack on the moon. And then, surely if we summon, flip summon Golem Sentry. We can destroy that, and then Attack of the Moon will be able to destroy Yumi. Yeah, very nice. So, goodbye Yumi, and goodbye Lobster. Nice. So, we shall reset him. And summon a Mammoth. Where did our uh, Wasteland go? Oh well. We'll go Mammoth. Just so we can do a bit of damage to him. 1200 to the face, and awesome. So what's he gonna do? Oh no, Mad Lobster! Ah, 500 down. Okay, well, we're gonna have to return that thing to his hand again. Uh, pull Burning Land. Uh, I might save that in case he gets another roomie on the field. So we'll summon um, Giant Soldier. And then we'll flip uh, Gol Golem Sentry to send that thing back to his hand. Uh, that's no, we don't need to attack on the moon because it'll destroy itself. So, oh no! We could have got rid of it, I think. Look at one spell. Yeah, we could. Oh well, it's fine. I don't think it's anything because he didn't activate it next time we attack, so. Face to the face. Also, we're chipping away his life points. Nice. 
Another mad love? Oh yeah, of course. I've seen another mad love store. Of course, I'm sending that thing back to his hand every turn. Okay, so... What do we do? Giant Soldier Stone. Beaver Warrior. We'll summon another Beaver Warrior. And of course, we'll activate Golem Sentry. To send that thing back to his hand again. And then we'll activate Attack on the Moon. To get rid of that. So, goodbye that. And back to your hand. Or Tornado War. It's not bad color. I think we'll attack with both this time. And then activate uh, Goblin... Uh, I don't know if you can... Well, I'm going to risk it anyway and use their attacks and hopefully still be able to switch that back to... Defend. Yes, we can. Awesome. Nice. We're all in there. I didn't actually know that, so that's something new. Oh, no, we got Umi. And a Mad Lobster. Ah. 700. Well, I'm afraid that they're both going to die again this turn. I don't know if to use Burning Land. Uh, or the well, because that destroys it as well. I need to take 500. Uh, well, summon Beaver Warrior. And uh, yeah, we'll use uh, Burning Land. Destroy that. And then we'll activate Golem's Sentry to send that thing back to his hand. And we'll summon another Goblin Sentry. And then we shall attack him with all three to do 2800. So it's giving away those life points. So next turn is going to take another 500 because of burning land as well. So he's, he's going to be down to 200 life points. Ooh, this is clutch. Can he do something? Burning land take 500 damage. Oh, he's got a mad, mad lobster. Oh, he's going to attack the golem sentry. Surely, yes, he is, bitch. Oh no, I forgot to use the effect. Mistakes were made. Oh damn. Oh, cursed dragon, yes. Right, okay, we're gonna curse the dragon. The people warrior. Um, well, we're gonna destroy them. Then we'll reset that thing. And we'll destroy that at last. Yeah, we won, of course. Yes, I didn't even realize. Awesome. Okay, thank you so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, forget to push like button, leave a comment down below. Of course, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Also, most comment on Twitter. Link down below as always. So, that's going to say, thank you so much for watching. I've been XDotKillerX, and I'll see you in the next Yu Gi Oh! video.